onto really the other side of the coin. We talked about maturity. One of the, you know, as we look at that uh, maybe 30 year journey, and especially in the last 15, probably what's been as striking as any is the maturity on the side of our vendor partners. That they too have done tremendous work, often under pressure from the clients to really push the envelope when it comes to process transformation and innovation. So it gives me great pleasure to welcome uh, Wipro Technologies and, in fact, somebody who you don't really want to mess with. Uh, that's Jonathan Lobel, and the description is in the addendum. He's a black belt, um, and actually a Six Sigma black belt, but uh, nevertheless, and he's also certified in BPM program management, Agile Scrum Master, and Lean, and also Jayantha Salagundi, who is the regional director of BPM and SOA practices. So please welcome Wipro. Yes. Okay, you got it. Sure. Good morning, everybody. Uh, am I audible? Okay. Uh, what we'll be covering in our conversation today will be around uh, process innovation. Uh, so we'll have a conversation of. Uh, around 30 minutes on uh, process innovation. What is our point of view on process innovation? And uh, we'll potentially have about 10 to 15 minutes unless we see the red sign from, uh, from the prof. Uh, so process innovation essentially uh, is an area where you, know, you focus predominantly on process changes or process improvements. Is process improvement alone sufficient for, for your organizations? So that is the point of view that we're going to discuss. I'm sure many of you are aware of uh, all the, you know, the dynamics that are happening because of regulatory changes across the board, whether it is uh, you know, creation of uh, the Consumer Finance Protection Agency or the Stability Council, or you know, many of the changes that are happening around uh, regulation of very complex instruments like derivatives or the mortgage reforms. So most of the underlying theme there is to protect consumers, investors from financial abuse, and also provide a lot of tools to manage financial crises. Right? So this is one of, one of the key uh, dynamics that your organization will have to deal with. And this is one of those changes which is sort of forcing your business process to take an outside-in view. So apart from this, there are, of course, a lot of demands from your customers for newer products and services. right? And uh, there will be a lot of pressures in terms of faster time to market from your perspectives. So how do you address all these business dynamics? So that is you know, one of the key uh, success factors to addressing these business dynamics is to make sure that your businesses have agile processes or your business agility is defined by how well you can transform your processes uh, by using some of the technologies like BPM technologies and using some of the best practices in innovating your processes. So that's essentially what we will cover. So in many of the engagements that Wipro has been implementing uh, BPM solutions or programs that we are running, we are, you know, for our financial services customers, we are, we are doing a lot of work around uh, three types of processes, you know, commodity processes, horizontal specific processes and processes which are very similar to vertical, uh, vertical or industry specific processes. Uh, horizontal uh, commodity services processes would be like uh, you know, client uh, contact center optimization or uh, uh, stuff around uh, customer capacity management, customer communication management, or a lot of uh, solutions around uh, uh, you know, the paperless initiatives or exception management or branch office automation. You know, many of these initiatives that we are implementing our, uh, for our customers, they really address mostly the bottom line, bottom line efficiencies. So you are essentially focused on achieving efficiencies and effectiveness through uh, straight through processing or process automation or optimization initiatives, right? So many of them actually address, uh, you know, purely focus on deriving hard cost savings, uh, saving time and money in terms of uh, 